Hello everybody, my name is Parak, and in today's video I got asked to go take on Volcana with the Greatsword because they seem to be struggling. I'd usually go fight the Arch Tempered one just because I find it to be a more enjoyable fight than the regular one in this game. But since they mentioned just Volcana, I assume they mean the regular one. So we're going to go take on the regular one. Of course, here is the build. It's still just the Arch Tempered Volcana with Frostfang Barrieth and the Fatalis Greatsword. It's the exact same build I've been using with the Greatsword when I play it. And yeah, let's go take on the Volcana. I'm also doing this quest here, just so I don't have to chase it down. Alrighty, so of course, grab yourself some rocks. It helps just to get that initial wallbang, and the weaken is very nice to have. You're going to be head sniping pretty much every single attack that Volcana does here. Volcana has a lot of openings with Greatsword. Same kind of deal as Monkey, in all honesty, at least with the Arch Tempered version. It's a lot like Monkey, where if you don't get that exact timing, you're going to miss an opportunity to get a punish. Same kind of deal. But uh, it, it shouldn't be that bad with Greatsword, in all honesty. I've done this one quite a lot. At least with the Arch Tempered one, so I imagine this is almost exactly the same. Get that Warbang, of course, into the Weaken. Just so we got the Weaken for the rest of the hunt, basically. I don't think she's going to last that long at all. Get the Sheath. Maybe a little bit of charge. Should roar, so should be almost guaranteed hit it. Yep, one more. Bite into me, thank you. Smack. Every time she does that evade, or like runs across the map, she'll either come back and bite, or she will, uh, that sh unlucky. Or she will, uh, do the sweeping frost. Also, that attack there that actually hit me, if you wait for her face to fully stop, you can actually land quite a huge chunk of damage off that. See, every time she sidesteps, she'll bite. Run, she'll bite or sweep. Oh, I guess this one doesn't um, bite or sweep every time then. That's interesting. There's the part break, of course. Let's just go over here, get... Mm, get off. Okay, just get some damage. We missed a lot of bloody damage because it decided to climb the wall instead of uh, doing what I was doing, but that's okay. Ice trail, that's fine. Just draw attack. Because I don't know exactly how long the openings last on this one. You can walk into this one, get a couple charges. Nice and simple. Grab on. I would usually uh, sling and combo the other direction here. But since we don't have any rocks, I'll just go with those two. I should have just charged the first one. Because I would have done a lot more with 100% affinity. But that's okay. There's our stun, I think. No, just a regular topple. So we've still got our stun lined up too. There it is. Nice and juicy from the Frostfang uh, gloves. Nice and easy. Oh, the, the pain of hitting bad hit zones. I should have just positioned back to the head, but kind of expected it to at least reach a little bit. That's all right. Bonk. Another stagger. Unfortunate that I don't have any rocks. Because uh, it would be real nice to deal good damage off that. You can TCS back towards where the head usually records, which is about here. As you saw, she did go back into it. And as I said before, when she sidesteps, she usually bites. You get a pretty decent opening there. She doesn't land yet. Unlucky AI. There you go. You can also uh, set up Slinger Shot there. If you position really carefully. And just land a, a TCS off that. But I'm not too sure on the spacing, and I still don't have rocks. So we're not going for it. Just a quick one. Nice and simple. One, two, three. I hit the arm, I think. That's alright. Two, three. That's a bit better. Hit the face that time. Roll. Out of Agitator, so the weaken's going to wear off soon too. But that's alright. Sweep, you get a full charge here. Oh, I was too fast. Usually, uh, I think the Arch Tempered one is just slightly faster with everything it does. So it usually, like, recoils back into it in time. But it is what it is. You get a, a free punish out of it, essentially. So it's not the worst thing. Okay, try to get this. I've messed up quite a few of them as of recently. I don't know why the wake up's so inconsistent, but it is what it is. There we go. Not too bad. Definitely got a weak in the face. If he uh, roars, we are unhappy. But it didn't. 
I'll take it. You can also tackle into that breath and then land a TCS off that if you're fast enough. Sweep because it went too far. Two, three. Yeah, so it is just like slightly slower than Arch Tempered. Roll in on this one, stay close. Same kind of deal. You can land a lot of damage here, actually. I think you can land full TCS off the ult. Or not. Okay. Guess it's only with the Arch Tempered one. It's okay. Nice and easy. We've got Slinger Ammo this time, and I've weakened recently, so we're gonna go to set up this. Aim it back that way. One, two, bang, bang. And there we go. She's not too bad with Greatsword at all. I, I just got thrown off a lot because the Arch Tempered one is quite a bit faster and she moves around way more than this. But that should definitely help out. Just slightly adjust what I've been doing in this one and you should be able to land pretty much every punish. She sets up you for a lot of things with Greatsword. It's just the Arch Tempered one gives a lot more and has better openings for the charge levels. Because pretty much as you finish them, Arch Tempered will move back in that time. As you saw, this one just slightly lasts too long. So maybe one less charge on most things. Or just greet it out and practice for Arch Tempered instead. You'll have a pretty good time. Slider Expert, interesting. Well everybody, that was another requested hunt this time to go take on the Velcana with the Greatsword. I'm sorry if you wanted to see Arch Tempered Velcana. I saw just Velcana there, so I didn't take it to Arch Tempered. Even though I prefer that fight, obviously. But hopefully that helps you with getting some clears, get yourself some of the materials to get her armor pieces. Especially if you're playing Greatsword as well. It's nice to have some of the equipment. For example, the crit draw is very, very nice to have. And then obviously once you get to Arch Tempered Volcana level, the pieces are incredibly good, as you can see. But hopefully that helps you out. I do still have all the requests written down as of prior. I think there's like three Bowgun ones, uh, Kolv Taroth and dual blades as of this recording at least so there's a few of you there to still go on be sure to leave any requests you have down in the comments and i'll get to it if it's within reason as always so thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you on the next one